At the Indo-Defense 2025 exhibition in Jakarta, the spotlight shines on the newly introduced Kaplan APC, known locally as the Haramo APC. This unveiling marks a significant milestone in the ongoing strategic collaboration between Turkish defense firm FNSS and Indonesia's PT Pindad, a partnership that previously bore fruit with the Kaplan MT, Haramo, medium tank project tailored for the Indonesian Army. Following the 2024 delivery of the Kaplan MT vehicles, which were locally manufactured in Indonesia under technology transfer agreements, this marks Turkey as inaugural export of a tank-type platform. Riding on this success, Indonesia's Ministry of Defense has once again entrusted FNSS and PT Pindad to jointly develop a new 30-ton tracked armored personnel carrier. The Haramo APC is engineered to provide exceptional battlefield survivability by combining modular design principles with robust ballistic and mine-resistant protection systems. It further offers the option to integrate active defense mechanisms capable of neutralizing incoming anti-tank missiles and rockets. The vehicle is built to accommodate a crew of 13, including a driver, commander, and gunner, and supports an open electronic architecture that seamlessly incorporates advanced mission systems like battlefield management software and omnidirectional cameras offering day and night situational awareness for both the crew and dismounted troops. Following the formal signing of a development and production contract at the Saha Expo in October 2024, the Haramo APC program is officially underway. Under this agreement, FNSS will produce the initial unit in Turkey, with subsequent vehicles manufactured by PT Pindad in Indonesia. The first deliveries are scheduled for late 2026, with joint qualification trials to ensure compliance with operational standards in both countries. Designed for versatile deployment, the Haramo APC performs reliably across diverse terrain types and climatic conditions. Its suspension system is optimized to minimize vibrations and improve handling. The vehicle is equipped with nuclear, biological, and chemical, NBC, protection, an automatic fire suppression system, and climate control features to enable continued operations even in hazardous environments. It supports modular weapon configurations, ranging from manned or unmanned turrets with light to medium caliber armaments, 120mm mortars, to anti-tank missile launchers. The vehicle's modularity enables it to fulfill a broad spectrum of battlefield roles, such as mechanized infantry transport, reconnaissance, command and control, medical evacuation, vehicle recovery, combat engineering, and direct or indirect fire support. All variants share a new generation armored chassis that boasts a power-to-weight ratio of at least 22 horsepower per ton, automatic transmission, and interoperability with contemporary main battle tanks. Significant component commonality exists between the Haramo APC, the Kaplan MT, and other FNSS tracked platforms, including parts borrowed from the Marine Assault Vehicle used by Turkey's Marine Infantry Brigade. This standardization reduces logistical complexity, enhances system reliability, decreases maintenance demands, extends mean time between failures, MTBF, and boosts overall operational readiness. This latest phase in the Turkey indonesia defense collaboration cements FNSS's role in advancing modular tracked armored vehicles while expanding PT Pindad's industrial capabilities in final assembly, integration, and life cycle support. The Haramo APC embodies both nations' commitment to delivering a flexible, scalable armored platform capable of meeting future battlefield requirements. Its debut at Indo-Defense 2025 highlights not only industrial progress but also potential interest for regional and global deployment opportunities.